Hello everyone, my name is Nicole and welcome to Pop Goes Arcade, a prologue to Pop Goes Evergreen, as you can see on the bottom of that text. But I wanted to start on this because it gives a rough idea of what we're getting into. And it's Pop Goes is a Five Nights at Freddy's spinoff series with its own unique story. The story is built from information presented in only Five Nights at Freddy's 1, 2, and 3 and is best enjoyed after experiencing those games first. It is also set in the same universe as the Five Nights at Candy series by Emil Mako. And as I stated, Pop Goes Arcade is a prologue to Pop Goes Evergreen. Also, it has controller support, so we'll be using that. And those are just the controls. Bah. And then warning, flashing lights, loud sounds, and disturbing imagery. You have been warned. But let's go into this because I'm excited to find out how this plays out. Apparently it's like an RPG, I guess. Bum, 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 bum. Continue to Pop Goes and the Machinist. Uh, we'll ignore that for now. We'll just do new game. Oh, oh, <laughs> look at the, the controls uh, below the screen are actually moving. The inn. So yeah, this is like a uh, RPG. I don't know if there's actual, Oh, hold on. Okay. Just, just, just a wee, wee bit too loud there. Um, also, yeah, the mentioned... Oh, I can just zoom in. I kind of want to stay making it look like that. Okay. Pop goes, what took you so long? We have a problem. Someone or something is draining the life of the surrounding forests. We, ha we need to put a stop to it. The North Forest has already fallen, so we need to prevent the effect from spreading to the others. Unfortunately, the North Forest has been locked behind a gate that needs three keys. Maybe they are hidden in the West, South, and East Forest? Please take a look, venture through the West Forest, and see what you can find. Find a key in the West Forest. Okay. Hi, Pop Goes. This is... Mandra? Mandra. Would you like to save your progress? Yes. Nice. If you ever get into trouble, I'll bring you back here with everything you have right now. Okay. It's still so loud. Oh, sweet Jeebus. Okay, so I need the West Forest. But yeah, I don't know if there's any actual... For this game, I don't know what horror elements it will have. Hello? This hole seems to be a part of a tunnel system, but I'm not stand strong enough to dig through it. Okay. I don't actually know much about the Pop Goes series of FNAF fan games. West Forest, aka the Autumn Forest. Oh! Oh! Yo! Pop Goes the Weasel. Attack for Corrupt Hedgehog. What if I block when you're blinking? Ah. So block when they're blinking because they're going to do a crit. Oh, you missed anyway. Ha ha. Also, I don't know how to do more damage. How does one do more damage? I have no items. But I'm going to lose. I can't run. And I, I, I died. You lose. Lose against a corrupt hedgehog before upgrading any stats. Well, I died. Okay. Bye. <laughs> okay. So I lost out on goodies. Hmm. Hi. Who are you? Stone, can you see those red beams in the sky, Pop Goes? No, I can't. They're, what red beams? You're seeing things, mate. Why does it look like there's something over here? Oh, there isn't. Okay. Weird. I thought there was something. That's unfortunate. So, I need to check the West Forest.
South Forest, aka the Green Forest. Okay. But they said the West Forest first, right? Can I interact with the giant mushroom? No. Mm, we got a RPG style battle system. <gasps> it's a gold one! Okay. Well, this is pretty simple. Very simple. Oh. Be sure to explore alternate paths. Look for gaps in the trees. You can buy items at shops and save your progress at inns. You just have to find them. Is there a, is there a secret? Nope, but I did find a corrupt hedgehog again. Ah! What happens if I attack him when he's doing crit? So I need to find a shop. Also, I can't, like, run. Yo, I scored a crit. I don't know how I got a crit, but I got a crit. Okay, please keep missing. I need to defeat you. Yes. Victory! I win! So, we upgrade with the money, I'm guessing. See, there's a gap here. It's an inn! No! No, 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 no! Okay, corrupt hawk. Oh, you're gonna hurt so much. Thank you for missing. I'm just going to be able to pull this off. We got to go to the inn. I was not expecting such a cool little RPG. Like, I knew it was an RPG. I wasn't expecting it to be cool like this. Hi, Pop Goes. Would you like to save your progress? Yes, please. Can I go into my room? You can. Thank you so much for purchasing the premium experience. As thanks, we have provided you with your very own luxury accommodation at the Forest Inns. You can rest here wherever you like. You can also decorate the place if you provide the paint. And lastly, Mandra has given you something called a bestiary. It's on the desk. It's a book that can be used to log your experience in the forest. More specifically... The enemies you may encounter. Completing the beast area won't add to your game's progression in the dead forest. However, it will give you something in the machinist. We hope you enjoy your stay at our... Uh, oh, it's the reflection. Oh. So yeah, uh, this is the paid version of Pop Goes Arcade. I couldn't actually find a... Uh... If I collect more paints. Cool. Um, I couldn't find a free version of this. Maybe I just didn't look hard enough. But it cost me like six bucks. Um, and it, uh, I've been getting really deep into the FNAF fan games. So it's like, I, I want to try this. Corrupted deer. Oh yeah, you are a deer. You did not look like a deer at first. At least you're weaker than the hedgehog and the hawk. Especially the hawk. Uh, this is going well. I would like to upgrade, but I haven't been able to yet. Can I interact with you? Look at all the money! Hello, Hawk. Okay, this is going to be a crit, but I wanted to see. Oh! Okay. I don't trust not to... Yeah. I didn't trust that it would miss. So, I get healed after every fight. That's good. That is very good. Oh, I can use the D-pad. It told me to use the analog stick, but I it was like, I'm pretty sure I can use the D-pad. There is a gap in the trees there, but 
we don't have the equipment to do it. Okay. Fascinating. Also, this deer sucks. I'm kicking the deer's butt. I just want to get this. So, yeah, unfortunately, I can't go this way. I think there's something behind this boulder, but I have no idea how to get through it. There. And then there's a path to the right here. We want to try... <gasps> it's a shop! And I got $285. Blake, hi, Pop Goes. You buying something? Hi there, Pop Goes. What would you like to buy today? Okay, so for... Attack Plus is a special potion that will give you for the next five turns. Oh! This is permanent. Okay. The cost is 75 for that. I do want that. An essential upgrade, yeah. And it's... Okay. Is that a permanent upgrade? Nope, that's... Shield is a magical spell that will give you invincibility for three turns. Ooh. 60 for you. There. I've buffed myself. So now we're going to be strong. Strong like ox. God! <laughs> Hell yeah! We're going to kick everything's butt. Oh, we should save. Hey, buddy. So, okay. So, would normally saving cost money as well? Is that what's going on? Also, apparently pressing the one button lets me, um, pressing and holding lets me speed up the talk. Okay. So, we buffed our health to 50. We have a max of 50 and our attack is now 8. That's that's good. Also, I do have Oh, wait. How do I do this? Ah. Okay, so that's how I do it. Don't exit the game. Progression 0%. <laughs> Saffron. Hey, I heard about your little quest. I tried looking for a key myself and I doubt there's one in this forest. But feel free to keep looking. It's a cage with fruit inside. The sign says that it's been set up to catch corrupt animals in this part of the forest. Okay. Interesting. I'm looking for anything that looks out of place. Okay, that's a zip line. We can't do anything with that. There's a pumpkin. Hey, bird! Oh! I, I'm not scared of the hawk anymore. <laughs> There's a pumpkin here. Ah, sorry, I was having a drink of water. Gotta hydrate before I dehydrate. Honestly, I'm really liking this. Granted, I love pixelated RPGs. This sign uh, warns of danger ahead, but it has been vandalized with red paint. I can make out a C and an A. Okay. Uh-oh. Chica! Corrupt Chica. You're clearly lost if you wandered here, pest. Stay away and you won't get hurt. But Chica, I can kick your butt with no problem. Oh, you have a jump? I'll block because I doubt you'll miss. I probably should have gotten some healing. That's not fair that you can jump. Do I get that ability? Oh my god, she actually is kicking my butt. And I lose. I lose. God damn. Okay, I need to grind. Ah, uh, oh! Oh, that's handy. Okay, so... We need to grind. Yeah, we need to grind. Because what we can do... This kind of reminds me of that one game Markiplier played, uh, Five Nights at Fuckboys. 
Kind of reminds me of that. But obviously... I guess just the RPG aspect of it reminds me of that, I guess. That's how, Yeah, that's about it. That's the only thing that it reminds me of. Um, we need to grind. And the only thing I can think of is... There we go. <laughs> so I have enough to get another power upgrade. That should put us at, what, 10? Because... That would be useful. Yeah, we have 115. It was 75. I guess, like, it might be smart. Plus two attack. So, yeah, that'll put us at 10. Um, That cost 25. That cost exactly 40. And I could also just get these, I guess. Or, ah, oh, five more and I could have got a spell. More. I can get a couple of those. There we go. There, I think we can actually go fight Chica. I guess we don't need to grind as much as I thought. Which is good. Which is good. God, that's half your health already. That was a 30! That was a 30%! So what we'll do is we'll quickly save. You know, gotta do the saving. It's standard RPG logic. Whoa! If you hold A and B at the same time, it really speeds up the text. Holy crap. Like, holding B sped up the text, but I wasn't expecting A and B to be that fast. Damn. Um, I gotta say, though, like, I am really liking this. I, I, I went down, so, these, this game was listed under Garrett McKay's website. Garrett McKay being the creator of A Bite at Freddy's. And so, I was like, okay. So, I was like, hey, why not try it? You're clearly lost. Look at that damage. And I have healing items. Your jump is annoying. I'll take the hit. I Because I can just heal. It's only 25%, but I can heal. Damn it. Okay, I, can, I just need one more hit. There we go. Corrupt Chica is defeated! You win! $50. $50! You got a gate key. Speak to Sarah in the Garden Inn. There's a jack-o'-lantern here. Can I not talk to you? Okay. This area is for Chica only. For she is the only one who can jump over this hole. Oh, so we get Chica's jump ability. That makes sense. Oh, and the zip line is probably Foxy's hook. Right? That would make sense. I guess. <laughs> I don't know uh, how much of any of this actually makes sense. I'm glad I uh, grinded, though. I don't know if that's gonna be detrimental in the future though this hole seems to be a part of a tunnel but I'm not strong enough to dig through it okay so we still can't do that makes sense makes sense we don't have anything for that um but okay so we're going back to the inn where Sarah is and then from there, we go south or east, I guess? I haven't really encountered any more corrupt hedgehogs yet, though. Which is interesting. It's really funny I got a steam achievement for dying <gasps> to it. Ugh. I'm okay. Eh. Eh. Let me in. No pun intended. Hi, Sarah. Pop goes. You found one of the keys. It was guarded by a chicken? An evil chicken with red eyes? How peculiar. Well, if you managed to get one key, why not try retrieving another? 
Try exploring the South Forest next. Hi, Pop Goes. Would you like to save your progress? Yes, because I'm actually all out of time here. Um, nice. If you ever get in trouble. Yeah, okay. So, I'm all out of time, as I stated. So, we're going to leave it here. I am going to continue this, though. I am actually having a lot of fun with it, and I do want to see where all of this goes. No pun intended, being called Pop Goes. But... Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, if you enjoyed this video, please drop a like on it. It really helps the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!